Hey guys, we are standing in the Lee Baron flagship store, which has officially been completed. The studio has been so hard at work trying to get this project up and running for our clients, and I'm so excited to share the final product with you today. One thing that was so major in this project was the artwork. It had to represent the city of Huntsville and everything that Lee Baron stands for. And Julie Mai, my amazing friend, did a fabulous fucking job on the art pieces. This custom piece behind me represents so many different symbols of Huntsville and Sam Houston State University and the Lee Baron brand as a whole, as well as Texas Pride. This piece is what sets the tone for the rest of the store, and I cannot even begin to explain how in love I am with Julie's artwork. If you know one thing about me, you know I'm a whore for a good chandelier. And this custom chandelier we designed with Luke Lamp Company is absolutely insane. It is the centerpiece for this entire store. It has chrome details. It is more than 16 feet wide. I mean, this is a fabulous art piece in itself. And the way that we hung it and suspended it through the space truly did exactly what it was supposed to do. I am in love with this piece. So for this space, we knew that we needed to do some sort of signage. And we toyed with the idea of doing a metal sign versus like an acrylic sign. And then we landed on a neon sign. And I had so many different places that I was trying to get this neon sign made until we found this fabulous spot in Houston, this small little mom and pop shop who makes custom neon signs and they hit the nail on the head. This custom sign is four feet wide. It is amazing. And they custom created this blue color just for the store to get that signature Lee Baron blue. And honestly, they did a fucking amazing job. I am in love with this piece and you see it straight from the front door, you know exactly where the fuck you are. And this is exactly what Lee Baron needed to take their branding to the next level. Let's be honest, is it even a Bilal Rahman project if there's not an element of black and white? The answer is no. This white and black detail that we've used in the main two arches right when you walk in really set the tone for the space and create an element of pattern, which is something that I really wanted to do to differentiate them from the arches in the back of the store. While those are just solid black, these needed to pop a little bit because they're in, in between all of the merchandise and all of the cool lighting, so they really needed to become a feature of the store. And I think that our artists did exactly that. So throughout the entire store, we really wanted to make it a point to use iconic pieces of furniture. That way we maintain a timeless design, these would never go out of style, and sets the tone for the Lee Baron brand and the future stores that we would design. Starting with the Warren table, this is just one of the iconic pieces that we've used in the space, along with the Rolu Poli chair and the Soriana sofa, as well as this custom checkout desk that we designed to house a display for them to put all of their cool jewelry and all the unique pieces for all of their clients. Lee Baron is really going into a new direction and we are so honored to be a part of their journey. I hope you enjoy the tour of the final Lee Baron flagship store. This is just the beginning for Bilal Rahman Studio and just the beginning for the next chapter of Lee Baron. Remember to subscribe and please follow me on all of my other social media and remember to elevate everyday experiences. Now get the fuck out of here.